Hi, how's everybody doing? This is Dr. Corey Murray, physical therapist at Provisio, and today I wanted to do a quick video to help out any of the dancers out there. So a common move in dancing is the demi-plie or the plie, and to successfully accomplish this move, you have to have great turnout. Now, a common complaint between dancers is pain that originates in their knees or their hips, and there's usually a very good explanation for this. So I'm going to go through a couple moves and I'm going to have Katie kind of come in and focus on my knees so that you can see what I'm talking about. So often when we try to move into that turnout position, what the dancer does is they start to rotate at the knee and at the ankle instead of at the hip. Now as she comes with a forward angle, as you can see as I'm looking over this, my knee and my foot are not in line. That's going to cause a stress around the knee joint, also stress up into the hip joint, ankle. This can start causing pain and problems there, okay? So what you want to work on with this is actually rotating only from the hip. I'm not rotating from my knee, I'm not rotating from my ankle. I'm successfully turning myself out with the hip. That way when I come down, if she comes down now, my knee is in a nice straight line right over the top of my toe. This is going to help diminish any of the pain that I start to experience while I'm going into the demi plies or the plies. Another common uh, way that the dancer is going to compensate is through an arch. So they're going to try to really arch within their back to get that turnout. They're going to get a big arch here. So I want to show you a nice exercise that you can work on at home that can kind of help strengthen not only the back but also the external rotators of the hip to kind of decrease if you are a dancer that's experiencing pain within your hips and knees. So what you're going to do is take, like, whether it be a, a ball or a pillow or something that you can brace up against your back, okay, and you're going to lie on your side. So you're going to place that ball or pillow right between the arch of your back, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of rotate my back, my hips forward, so that I start to feel pressure within the ball. So I'm pushing that ball into the wall. This isn't going to prevent me from arching my back. I'm pushing back into it. Once I hold that position, I start to go from the hips only, and I'm rotating my leg out. All the rotations coming from the hips, I am not rotating anything within my knees or my foot. And this is not an easy task. So once again, what you're gonna do is push the pillow or a ball up against the wall and then completely rotate that leg out using those external rotators in the hip. If you're currently a dancer and you're experiencing any knee or hip pain, um, feel free to check out our website at www.prophysiomt.com and have a great rest of your day. Thanks.